Good afternoon. We are here this afternoon to announce the hiring of our seventh men's soccer coach here at Saginaw Valley State University. I would first like to thank the search committee, George Eastland, Samantha Cool, Nick Wagner, Michael O'Neill, and Zach Myers, and the leadership of Associate Athletic Director and Senior Women's Administrator Angela Pohl for, for the hard work throughout this search process. This search process involved finding a coach to take over an already successfully nationally recognized program and continue to raise the bar. We wanted to be consistent with all of our coaching hires with the qualities that are important to us here at SVSU. A coach that has a strong belief in our number one department goal, which is graduation and retention. A coach that will treat our student athletes with the utmost respect. A coach with a great athletic, who will be a great athletic department teammate. A coach who is going to be involved in the university community and the community at large. And a coach who is not afraid to set the bar at competing at the national level for national championships. We believe we have found those qualities in the gentleman I'm about ready to introduce. One of the really intriguing thoughts about this gentleman is he has always seemed to pursue a challenge. He's won back-to-back -back national championships as a head coach at the club level. He's been an assistant coach at the University of Michigan and Oakland universities, where he has been part of competing for championships at the collegiate level. He brings all of the qualities that we felt for ne were necessary to continue to raise this men's soccer program to the expectations that people have now for SBSU men's soccer. It is my pleasure to introduce the seventh and the new head coach of SBSU men's soccer, Andy Wagstaff. Thank you, Mike. That's a wonderful uh, introduction. I really appreciate it. Um, when, the, when the position became available recently, uh, when Kale Wasserman, uh, the former head coach here, who I will say did an amazing job and, and uh, built a, a program that was a national contender and still is, um, and has, has created a tradition and a history in the program that is something that enticed me and intrigued me when it became available. So Kale and I had a conversation about the position a couple of weeks uh, before the interview process and he explained to me how uh, wonderful he thought I would be for the role if, if I got the opportunity and how we had many similarities as coaches. So um, he also told me about the athletic department, the soccer team, the quality in this program and it was something that I really got excited about. So after the interview process, and I, I got a phone call from our athletic director, Mike Watson, to tell me that I've been offered the head men's soccer coach at Saginaw Valley State University. I was ecstatic, I was privileged, and I was honored. So I'm here now in the role and thoroughly enjoying it. It's been a couple of days of working with the players and getting to know all of them and all their attributes and characteristics, and they're a fine bunch of young men. And that is one of the things that intrigued me about the program. Also, the facilities and the, the uh, family atmosphere that surrounds the athletic department it was something that also brought me uh, to this position. One of the things that excites me is the passion and the drive of this athletic department to win national championships. I should say to win championships, but with the end game of winning national championships. And that is something that uh, was, was a challenge for me that I wanted to take. So I'm very privileged, I'm very honored to be part of the staff here I'm looking forward to a very bright future with a fantastic team and I intend to bring more championships to the athletic department here with the men's soccer program. I will say that on behalf of my wife Lindsay and my baby Charlotte and my family, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm honoured and excited to, to take on this challenge and I do want to thank our athletic director Mike Watson, Angela Paul and the rest of the uh, search committee 
and also um, Jim Molidor for all the attention and time that they gave me through the interview process. And I'm just really excited to get started with my first game as the head coach tomorrow against the University of Detroit at Ultimate Soccer at 2.15 p.m. Coach SVSU, uh, Director of Athletic Media Relations, Eric Brookhouse here. And first of all, welcome aboard. Uh, glad to have you in the Thank family. You. And um, just, you know, a lot of times you'll see, you know, coaching changes that come with, you know, maybe struggling programs. Certainly not the case here. Obviously, we've been competing on the national stage for, you know, several years. What's that like for you as a coach coming into a program like that that's already experienced a ton of success? I think that was the, the challenge that I wanted to take. Um, again, knowing Kale very well, and, and he talks so highly about the program, uh, in particular about the desire and the passion of the, the athletic department here to support their coaches to get success with their team. So it was something that was more of a challenge for me and excited me as opposed to something that would scare me away. Um, I also think that there's always room for improvement, and I think Kale will be the first to tell you that. I mean, the, the team can continue to get better and we can continue to win more and be more successful. But at the end of the day, it's not just about the on-field uh, success. It's also about the classroom and the student athletes and, and getting a fantastic education here at the university and, and learning the life skills that they're going to take with them uh, for the rest of their lives, basically, is, is what my role, hit, role is here as the head coach. So all of those things excited me and, and, and made me want to take this position. It wasn't something that ever made me feel like it was a challenge that I couldn't stand up for. Okay, I know you hit on it a little bit in your uh, kind of introduction there. And yeah. what about, you know, talk a little bit more about the facilities. I know, um, you know, everybody's been kind of marvel marveling about the, yeah. the new field house. But what is it like knowing as a coach when you face adverse weather, like we've certainly had the past yeah. couple of weeks here in the beautiful Michigan, knowing that you can come inside and still get a full workout and get your training in without missing a beat? Listen, there's no doubt in my mind that the athletic facilities here at SVSU are amongst the best in the nation. There's absolutely no doubt. I, I didn't really realize until I was here on campus just how spectacular it is. Like you said, the field house is, is just out of this world. But from a soccer perspective, we have our own training field that we can train on without anyone else on that field. Uh, the women's team have their own field. And then we share a game field that's a fantastic surface. It's got a nice stand stadium. Um, it's just a really professional setup uh, for uh, college sports. And uh, again, it was something that was another um, enticing part of the, of the job for me to come and take, knowing that the facilities and the support are right there for me. Okay, now just one more question here. What, what about the program that you envision running here at Saginaw Valley State would make it really appealing to a potential student athlete that may be interested in to compete on the Division II level in intercollegiate athletics? I think there's a number of factors, but I think one of the things from a, from a purely playing standpoint, if there's players that are looking to play at that level and are good enough to play at that level, I think the brand of soccer uh, that is played here, and again, I, again, the former staff have done a great job, and I will bring my style and my approach to the way we play the game. Um, one of the things I said in my interview and one of the things I've already talked to the players about in, in my presentation to them was I want the fans, the alumni, uh, their, their players' families and the athletic department to come to our games and, and, and notice and see the style of soccer that we're playing and, and it's an exciting brand. Now granted, you know, it's about getting results at the end of the day, but we will, we will play a brand of soccer that people want to want to come and watch. And I think that is, is a, a very, very important part of the, of the puzzle here. So in addition to great academics, phenomenal facilities, uh, a powerhouse team that, that's got a national championship as an agenda, um, it, we're going to play a great, a great brand of soccer. So, so that's, what, that's what I'm looking for in, in, in players and in the team that I'm going to put out on the field. All right. Thanks a lot, Coach. And once again, welcome aboard. Thank you.